So over here you can see that I have a scene and a car right here. So let us add an animation to this. So I'm going to add in a keyframe right here and then I'm going to go around onto the other place and drag the car right here so you can see that the keyframe has been added out. But if I were to go around and then press the play button, you can see that the car starts and stops abruptly. There is no acceleration or deacceleration whatsoever. But if you want to keep that out, then you can work around with A's in and A's up. So I'm going to go around, click on the first keyframe right here. You can see that this is here, as you can see, and there's the last keyframe right here as well. So over here, if I were to click, you can see that there's A's in and A's out that gets active. So if I were to go around and increase, so if I were to click and hold this, you can see that it um, jumps up in point right here. Or you can go around and let's say the A's in is going to be for 0 0.5 seconds right here. So if I were to go around and press the play button now, what happens is that you can see that the car actually uh, starts slowly right here. It eases in right here and slowly accelerates towards the end. But you can still see that at the end, it actually abruptly stops. So now if you don't want that, then you can go around onto uh, the is out section right here and then change this out as well. So I'm just going to go around right here and this is going to be for, let's say, one second itself. So now, if I were to go around and press the play button, you can see it starts and it slowly halts down right here. I'm going to go around and click and drag this, and this is what you have. So you can go around right here, from starting to end, you can see that there is a small set of motion. And that is how you can add in A's in and A's out um, um, animation inside of Toon Boom and then uh, what you can also do is add in an A's in and A's out in camera. So to the, do that I'm going to go around onto camera itself right here and let's say I'm going to uh, zoom it out. So here you can see that this is the first uh, camera keyframe so let me just go around right here. This is the camera right here just like this. So in order to go around and add in a keyframe right here, I'm going to go around on the camera. Let me just add in a keyframe right here. And then over here, I'm just going to go around and then change around the keyframe over here as well and press the plus button. So here you can see that there's a camera keyframe over here as well. So now I'm going to go around onto the beginning, onto the beginning camera keyframe that's there. I'm going to go around onto the end camera keyframe. Uh, right here and then resize this so there's a bit of an animation going on so you, there you go there's the camera keyframe animation as you can see right there and now if I were to go around and click over here you'll be able to see A's in and A's out over here as well so let me just go around and increase out the A's in right here instead of the camera to start abruptly and increase out the A's out over here as well. So once this is done, I can go around and press the play button can, and you can see that the camera movement is smooth as well. So you can go around and see that it smoothly zooms out as you can see and does not abruptly change out the angles. And that is how you can add an A's in and A's out in animations and in uh, camera movements inside of Toon Boom Storyboard Pro. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.